everyone. Welcome back to the channel. Today, we're going to talk about what to do when your manifestation is just not coming. My name is Stephanie. I'm a psychotherapist turned manifestation coach. I talk about all things for you to actually manifest your desires. If you're interested in that type of information, go ahead and subscribe to the channel. Hit the notification bell. Like the video if you like it. Also, look in the description below. I've got some information down there, some free and some paid goodies, and also how to work with me. All right. So you're doing everything, everything. You're spending so much time on this. You've gotten clear on what you wanted. You've written it out. You put in all the details of it. You know what you want. You're putting in the work. You are doing all the conscious mind techniques, maybe even some subconscious mind techniques, and you're still not getting what you want. All right. So first of all, Go ahead and switch what you're doing from mostly conscious techniques to subconscious mind techniques. That needs to be the majority of your work. The majority of your work. Again, don't stop doing the affirmations and things like that. Definitely still do them, but do the majority of your work subconscious mind techniques, okay? So that's one. So subconscious, in case you haven't been watching my videos, subconscious techniques, I mean, hypnosis, um, guided meditation, regular meditation, subliminals, um, state of kin to sleep. Okay. So you're, but you're doing all the things and let's say you are doing the subconscious techniques, uh, mostly, and it's just, it's been some time. It hasn't shown up. You don't feel any different. You don't see any changes. This is what I want you to do. I want you right now to look at what you're trying to manifest. Look at what you're trying to manifest. Maybe write it down. And I want you to ask yourself, or does this feel out of reach for me? Does it feel out of reach for me? And I also want you to ask yourself, is this manifestation um, a thing, a circumstance, person, or is it something that I want to change about who I believe myself to be? If your manifestation is not anything to do with changing who you are being, then I want you to take a step back and start over there. So basically, I want you to stop what you're doing and work on your self concept, who you believe yourself. To be once you gain your manifestation. Who is that person? Who is that person? Because that's what you want to manifest in yourself. You want to manifest the characteristics of that person. Because the reasons why you're not getting your manifestation in this case is because you have not changed yourself. And for whatever it is you're trying to get, that may be a prerequisite that you have to change who you are being. Manifestation is energy work and you are changing your energy. You can't manifest a thing that's vibrating on a certain frequency if you're not also vibrating or working towards vibrating on that frequency. So the best way in that case to do that is to work on who you want to be as that person who has the manifestation. Okay, so like, for example, if you are manifesting a million dollar business. You are manifesting a million dollar business, but 
you know, you're doing all the techniques, all the stuff, but every day you wake up and you have no motivation. You have no motivation but to do your manifestation routines. It's not coming to you. <laughs> because having a million dollar business means you need to operate with a million dollar mind. So that means it, it depends on what it means to you. So I know for me, it means, okay, a million dollar business, man, I'm motivated. I'm going to get up every morning and, and do my work knowing that I am helping millions and millions of people and happy to do all the work and happy to take each little step. I'm starting small now, but I'm getting it done. I'm checking things off of my list. Like I'm so excited about my business. I'm so excited about this venture. I'm so excited that I have this in my life. I feel so blessed to have this in my life. Like that's the kind of energy that I believe that a million dollar business person would have consistently. So if you can't trick yourself into feeling and being that way consistently, then do the subconscious mind techniques to brainwash yourself to being motivated, to being passionate, to being grateful for this business venture. Do you see? So, you know, not to say that what you're doing with manifesting the end is not working for you, but it may take a long time because you've got to change yourself. But if you go ahead and start changing who you believe yourself to be now, then when you combine your efforts with doing that work and changing who you are, manifesting the characteristics of the person who has that, then it'll be magical. And it's going to ha it's definitely going to happen for you. You just have to be consistent and make those changes because you're creating a whole new belief system, a, a complete different paradigm, changing all of your programming and be open to that. Everything will change, but just take a step back and start there. All right. So that's all I have for today's video. If you're interested in me helping you change those, those subconscious belief patterns and belief systems, taking out the stuff that's not serving you anymore and replacing it with who you would rather be. Just let me know. My information is below and I'll see you for the next video. Bye.